to touch up on a few things here. Everybody's all concerned about their freedoms and their rights and all this kind of stuff. You know, they're running around uh, listening to a bunch of assholes. You know, these so-called freedom fighters that you got out there running around working for you, they're working for the government and they're working for these uh, 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 controlled opposition groups, you know. And all of them, I'm telling you right now. If you want to listen to anybody that's up there going to Ottawa and all that bullshit and any of these protests and that that's going on, you lost the plot. They're all coiners, man. Every single one of them. They're all looking for money. They're all sellouts. They're all free Masonic scumbags, right? And if they're not a scumbag, they're associated with them. Anyway, you can listen to a Stand For Me or stand for uh, whatever you want to stand for, or, uh, you know, um, listen to Shane Sharp and that uh, Scab Shep, and these, they're building a house in Mexico on your expense. All these people out there that are grifting, 110%, man. That whole shit show with Jordan Peterson and all this kind of stuff, he's another grifter 110% too. All of them. Every single one of these guys that you're seeing on your fucking uh, dance card guys are nothing but scumballs, right? They have no idea where freedom is. You know what? Yeah, this is freedom, right? You know, the end of the human condition. You don't know where the fuck you are. Most people are living on a goddamn spinning ball going through time and space at 66.6 thousand miles a minute. You're fucking lo loco, right? You gotta get into this education thing. Right? Can you stand the truth? Really, can you? Chronicle of man's imprisonment. It's a soul farm, you fucking idiots. Why do you think these governments can just get away with bombing the shit out of everybody and keeping everybody living in their fear porn 110%? You know? And, and the history's a lie. Here, this is your Holocaust. Okay? Eisenhower's Ryan Meadows camps. All those fucking poor people that died in Germany and got bombed the shit out of the fucking Allies. Right with the phosphorus bombs. Put in concentration camps for doing nothing. But they just starved them to death. And they all died from typhus and all this kind of stuff. And then they call it some crazy holly hoax. Anyway, I'm not saying there wasn't no fucking people that died, but the whole thing is a shit show. And if you think that going to these freedom rallies with all these fucking retards that are moral degenerates, you know, uh, you can listen to that double poke retard fucking Derek B that's dancing around with his kitty dolls and accusing everybody of weird shit, man. I mean, I haven't gone down to this Queen's Park shit because I'm not going to be participating in any kind of mental mind fuck games going on. And you can go down to your little rallies on February 18th down there with the Chris the Fly. And th th these are puke, man. Every single fucking person that's going to be there, as far as I'm concerned, is a fucking goddamn dis it's a disinformation agent. And they all they do is lie the fuck out of everything. You got it? You want to listen to these people? Fine. Right? But I don't do that. As far as people on the internet goes, you know, this uh, whole fucking thing is a shit show. About 85% of the bullshit you see out there in the internet is garbage, and the 15% of it might even be worth looking at, and that's iffy. You know, this is fucked, man. And you got all these people that are just supporting all these guys, and they're all they are is keyboard warriors, man. There's a few people out there that I respect big time, right? I don't like people like John Levy that says he's the king of Tartaria. He's telling this to Paul Cook, who's an actual guy that does some real research. And Paul Cook's 
puts John Levy at the game 110%. John Levy's a scab, right? He doesn't give anybody pumps, perks on the back, nothing. The guy's all about himself. Every single one of these fucking assholes that's out there are just nothing but fucking cunts. Anyway, I'm done with dealing with these fucking archaics fucking followers and this fucking retarded bullshit. Are you kidding me? If you're into that kind of stuff, unsub my channel and just fuck right off. I mean, I've had enough of all the stupidness and especially all the bullshit I'm seeing on YouTube and all these fucking channels running around trying to make a fucking dollar off everybody's fucking likes, shares, and subscribes, or don't. I don't know, I'm just a little bit hot-headed right now because I've seen so much bullshit and every time I gotta do something, this fucking whole world's sucking the shit right out of you. Money, 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 fear, 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 anxiety, anxiety, stress, and all this kind of shit. Fuck it all, man. I don't worry about nothing, right? I'm going out, I gotta do think, something for a couple hours, and, and uh, that's the way it goes, man, right? I'm not going out living in fear. I don't give a fuck about this fucking world. I ain't here to fix it, and neither was Jesus. And if you're waiting for him to come back in the class to fix you, you may as well be waiting for fucking Donald Trump to fucking fix you, okay? Because he's another fucking character in the game, too. And the Muslims, and the Jews, and a whole bunch of the Cathars, and the Albigensians, all these people that knew Jesus as a real dude, right? The Roman Catholic Church is the one that fucking put him on that cross, okay? The Muslims don't have any image, any images of fucking Jesus bleeding to death on a fucking cross. You gotta be kidding me? This your savior, and they're gonna fucking put that out for the kids to see as soon as you fucking walk into a church? You fucking wackos. Thank you, Roman Catholic Church, for that bullshit, because you know what? All these organizations are created by these fuckers, right? And they're all worse than the, the demigod of this earth, right? That'd be Satan or whatever the fuck you want to call it. This is fucking Satan's gig. It's not our gig. It's your job to figure out what the fuck we're doing here, because this is a prison plane, and you got to escape, right? That's where you better get into these kind of books and stuff like that. Thick. Read them, right? Or don't. Peace and love, man. God bless you. Ciao.